Good afternoon, Sugar Loafers, and welcome to WSKI's weather update. Brought to you by the Widowmaker Lounge, upstairs of Base Lodge. Swing on up, check it out. Very nice new renovation. For Thursday, we got a little pretty pretty nice little day, mostly cloudy out there. Possibly, possibly, maybe some flurries here and there. But Thursday evening, it is going to get quite cold and windy. So far, they're saying around um, zero degrees, something like that. But we'll we'll have to watch and see. Friday, looking pretty good. We got a little bit of clouds still hanging out. But overall, it's a little bit warmer. It's around 19 to 23 degrees at the at the summit. Winds roughly around 25 miles an hour, so not too, too bad. And for your extended forecast, oh, it's looking pretty good so far. We got a little bit mostly cloudy on Saturday. Sunday, possible snow showers. We'll keep you posted on that. And Monday, another chance of possible showers. And hopefully, we'll get a little bit of action out of one of those storms the trails are doing pretty well. We have um, a couple new inches of snow you'll see out there. And while you're out skiing and riding, you'll see that the snowmakers are working hard, also trying to add trails all the time. Currently for Thursday, we're looking at about 30 trails running on four lifts. Do please remember on Thursday, the Super Quad is scheduled for maintenance at noon, so it will be closed at 12 o'clock on Thursday. And the snowmaking is going to continue all over the place. They're making on sluice now, and narrow gauge, the birches, scoot, double bitter, winter's way. And they are getting close to possibly opening up some more terrain by the weekend. We'll have to wait and find out. Hopefully that'll come true. They're still grooming along uh, down low, up high, and where possible. Currently, the lifts you can ride are Skyline and Super Quad. Do remember on Thursday, the Super Quad will be closed at noon. And down low, you got Double Runner and Skidway. I believe they're scheduled to open Saw Duster on Friday, so we'll look forward to that. Cross Crutchy Skiing, still on narrow gauge. For a few more days, this weekend, Saturday, is going to be open at the Outdoor Center, so you'll have plenty more cross country skiing. And tonight is Holiday Ortman Painting at Casey's Creativity Center down in the valley. That would be a great time for you and the family to go down and decorate the, the tree real nice with some personal touches. And while you're down in the valley, it's Burger and Beer Wednesday at Sugar Bowl. So swing on in, play a few rounds of bowling and games and other things that they have going on there. So that'll be a great time. And remember, warm up at Java Joe's right in the village at Sugarloaf. You can swing on in. There's always uh, good coffee and small edibles, which is really nice and handy to have a little, little bit in your stomach. And you can always check out all this and more on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. We update quite often, and you can see what's happening around the mountain. And you can always check us out on WSKITV.com. We have Behind the Archives, f From the Archives, and you'll see other good programming from the outside channel and WSKI.